159 kills with an MGB nuke using a brand new WSP 9 class setup. I know for a fact you guys can go crazy with. If you're looking for a three shot setup, I got you guys covered. If you guys enjoyed, feel free, drop a like on the video, subscribe to the channel, turn on the notifications. Let's jump right into it. Let's go ahead and create the new three shot WSP 9 class. I dropped 159 kills with an MGB nuke with this setup. I know for fat, you guys are gonna go crazy with. Now, for the first attach, we are gonna be running a muzzle. We're gonna be returning to the Shadow Strike Suppressor S. We're removing ourselves from the radar. That's all we need to do here, allowing us to get behind their spawn, build up a quick and easy streak, and drop those nukes. This is an amazing attachment on this SMG. Now we are going to be rocking a barrel as well on this class setup and instead of rocking the WSP Reckless 90 long barrel, which I know I've been recommending on a lot of the WSP 9 classes and WSP swarms for that matter, we are going to be returning to the HISS short light barrel because we are going to be running and gunning and dominating. We're getting increased aim down sight speed, sprint to fire speed and sprint speed with this attachment. If you're trying to be aggressive, this is gonna be the way to go because the cons are gonna be completely irrelevant. This gun does not have a super fast fire rate, so it really is easy to modulate the trigger and allow yourself to be accurate up to those medium ranges where this weapon is gonna be kind of capped off at. This is gonna be a running gun, but hard hitting SMG. Now, we are gonna be rocking an underbarrel, and we're not gonna be running what we normally run on submachine guns. We're not gonna use the FTAC MSP 98 hand stop. We're not gonna run the X10 Phantom 5 hand stop, or maybe even a vertical grip. Instead, we're gonna be rocking the XRK Edge BW4 hand stop, which is gonna be taking this weapon to the next level as far as close quarters combat goes. We have improved aim walking speed, movement speed, aim down sight speed, and sprint to fire speed everything we need on a running gun WSP9 setup so we can wipe out everybody we come across at those close ranges. Do not sleep on this. Now, we are gonna run a magazine. This is gonna be kind of contradictory, but we are gonna be rocking just the 32 round mag. We want to make sure we have the fastest ADS possible, and honestly, because the weapon does not shoot that fast, 32 is more than enough. I was able to kill three people very easily with this attachment, so definitely go ahead and rock this. But if you are struggling with the 32 round mag, the 40 is also a great option. But just to go ahead and have a fast ADS, we're going to be rocking that 32 round magazine. And then finally, we are going to be running an optic. And instead of rocking the jack glassless, because we do not want to slow down the ADS, we're going to rock the standard slate reflector here, giving us a clean optic picture because the iron tights on the WSP9 are not the best. Let's be honest. They're nah, they're just not it. So once you go ahead and equip all these attachments, you're going to see that we have a class setup that has a fast 80. I mean, look how quick this is. Great ADS speed and obviously very, very easy to modulate and control at those medium ranges because this weapon does not have a fast fire, but it is hard hitting. For the remainder of the setup, we are going to be going ahead and running the Renetti, which is going to be disgusting. This is the only reason why I got the nuke, because I had the Renetti. We have um, Jet Ferocity Carbine Kit. This is going to be a good option here. Transform this into literally a submachine gun. We are rocking the 50 round drum. We have um, the SL Skeletal Vertical Grip. We are utilizing the Compensated Flash Hider. And we are also going to be rocking the Slate Reflector on this as well. Now, do not forget to run the Munitions Box, Scavenger Gloves, Covert Sneakers, Bone Conduction Headset, Ghost TV camera to keep us off the radar, as well as the comms vest, which is going to be acting like a 24-7 UAV. Every time you kill somebody, run over their body, they're dropping a radar beacon, letting you know where everybody is at. And because we are running and gunning, we're having a 24-7 UAV. Believe that. This is a nasty class setup. I believe this is actually my most kills so far here in Modern for 3, so it definitely is putting in work. If you guys enjoy, feel free. Drop a like in the vid. Subscribe to the channel. Turn on post notifications. Let's go ahead and get in the gameplays. And by the way, if you need help leveling up your weapons but don't have enough time to play, Brown Magician is your solution. From unlocking all your attachments to getting gilded and interstellar camo, they offer legit services on Modern for 2 as well as 3. Check them out down in the description. All right, so we can do here on Stash House. I think, ironically, the last time I played this map, I was running the WSP9. Like, this is a pretty bad map. Not because it's, like, you know, small, but the spawns 
are just horrible. So you really can't even run a gun because if you do, you best believe they're gonna spawn behind you, shit next to you. I mean, look, look at that. As I just said that, somebody spawns literally to the left of me. Like what? I saw you, teammate. Come on, brother. I'll literally just watch his ass spawn in. Him too. Oh my god. They're gonna spawn around the corner here. Watch. Yep, I hear him. I got a VTOL. Target online. What? Yo, that shit was coming for me. Advanced UAV standing by. Advanced. Copy, advanced UAV is orbiting the AO. Scanning the threat. EMP is ready for deployment. Hardpoint compromised. <laughs> It's definitely EMP time. Does the SAE shut down? Does that shut down the SAE? It doesn't. Uh, why does that not shut down the strike, bro? Why am I even running the EMP? If it wasn't for distort, like messing the HUD up, dude, this would be literally a, a garbage kill streak. Thirty-five. Thirty-six. Hard point compromised. Secure the area. Hard point relocating. Thirty-seven. Hard point relocating. Secure the target area. All the way down thirty-nine. Chased. GG. I can't blame him. I can't blame him. I would have done the same shit. Hard point 
Oh shit, teammate. Stand by. Friendly UAV online. Enemies inside the perimeter. Target area updated. Hardpoint compromised. Damn, you can't shoot through that. Oh my God. I drop this. I knew this shitty oh. game was gonna put them behind me. I lit. Oh, I was about to get a double. I cut, bro. I was on. Oh my god. I was thinking, man, if I get this double, there is 100% time for a triple. But there's no way that's happening now. I just want my 100 plus kills, honestly. I'm at 88. I don't trust this nuke to get it for shit either. Four. 
Secure the area. Ooh, that's There's actually like plenty of time to drop something nasty. Move, teammate shit. Shit drone, are you serious? It have to have a I have a shitload of kills in this lobby. Dude, I've a, yeah, I would have had another. I would have one hundred percent another new. I gotta pay close attention. I'm trying to get. Tearing these kids up. I'm praying that this shit gives me my new. I'm praying this shit gets. I got 150. any kills I got dude really I couldn't have got the 160 159 Ugh, I, I'm sounding so ungrateful but that was badass all right let's get busy with the WSP 9 one of the higher damage SMGs I'm getting chased teammate move out the way brother They're all dead. They're all dead. What? Who runs the grenade launcher? You gotta be kidding me. What's it over here? The nice thing about this setup is we have max damage as well as max mobility. But we are for real cooking. Got a flank. Go, baby. My bad. Thing about this that I do like 
Like if they're damaged, you're gonna get like a two shot kill for the most part, which is super, super nice. Back it up. High point relocated. Secure the target area. Good shit, teammate. Keep it moving. I really don't like when the hill is in this area that it is right now because it is so easy for them to sit back and sit in corners. They got a kid with a grenade launcher, which is very, very, very irritating. thing about this spot not that many people like anticipate you to be up here because it's like such a rat spot nice is he upstairs or downstairs let's go baby that was a perfect time to drop the cmp Rotate over here. They have one fellow that spawned behind us for some reason. Why did he? No, oh, three now. What the fuck? Nice. Holy shit. That was a little too close. Way too close. Thank God I had this pistol. I got taken out. Got a headshot. God damn, bro. That was actually insane. Like, the amount of people that I was just taking out, like. Copy. Phoenix. Hard point relocating. Stand by. We have taken the lead. Hard point relocated. Secure the target area. how much I really do enjoy the WSP9, literally. the 
enemy next hard point. Stand by. Target area updated. Move to the hard point. Smallest copy, Phoenix 2-3 on station. Standing for hostiles. Friendly mosquito deployed. Enemies inside the perimeter. Advanced. Copy. Advanced UAV entering the AO. We need to wrap. EMP is ready for deployment. I think we can get a double. Hard point relocated. Secure the target area. Secure the area. You're kidding me, right? You're kidding me, right? Oh my god, bro. That's the only problem with the EMP. Motherfuckers be playing weird. I don't know what I was on. Probably like a 20, something like that. An early 20. Damn. There's like 10 guys in that fucking hill, dude. I was definitely, I was on a brutal. Uh, I just bodied those two kids. I was. Ah! Holy shit. I would have had a nuke double for sure. Cause I'm one off another 10. My God. There's no fucking way he. Yep, there wasn't a, a kid AFK. Hard point relocating. Stand by. Copy. Phoenix 2 3 is on station. Oh, it's not going to come in in time. Oh, yes, it will. Target area. Yep, we've got no kills, but hey, that's normal. 90, almost a double. That's a dub.